An arm robber jumps the gate, followed by another bad guy. The daring break-in is happening during the dinner hour. Waving a gun, the suspects sneak up on the startled homeowner who's just returned home. He throws his hot tea at them, and then he fires his own gun. A shootout unfolds, and the homeowner takes cover while they escape. I was walking, and my wife was about to have dinner, and the only thing that went to my mind was protecting my kid. Vince Ritchie's baby girl was asleep upstairs. Right on the other side of this door is my dining room. My wife is sitting right there. Yeah. And I was like, there is no way I'm letting them a house. There have been a string of these kind of dinner time burglaries. Yeah. People know that folks are home at this time, yeah. and they're so brazen. Why do you think these crooks are becoming so brazen? I think because when they come in when people are there, it's very easy to get what you want, because you can tell them, give me everything. At another Los Angeles home, these burglars also choose dinner time for their attempted break-in. The three crooks creep up along the house. Look, this masked intruder peers inside. Suddenly, they are on the run after the homeowner confronts them in his boxer shorts with his gun and chases them away. Homeowner George Lozano shows me how he confronted the burglars. I looked, he took off, I had to do this, and then I proceeded that way. And you had your gun in your hand? Yes. Get this, the homeowner has 15 surveillance cameras mounted in plain sight, yet it didn't deter the brazen dinnertime burglars. Are you surprised that this group of thieves are going around around dinner time and breaking in? That's the first I've heard of, yeah. As for the dad who opened fire, in a surprising turn, he says his concealed weapons permit has now been suspended. He has this message for the Los Angeles County Sheriff. From a father to a father, let me protect my family. 